An ashrama in Hinduism is one of four age-based life stages discussed in Indian texts of the ancient and medieval eras. The four ashramas are Brahmacharya, student; Grihastha, householder; Vanaprastha, retired; and Sannyasa, renunciate. The ashrama system is one facet of the Dharma concept in Hinduism. It is also a component of the ethical theories in Indian philosophy, where it is combined with four proper goals of human life purasartha, for fulfillment, happiness and spiritual liberation. Topic ashram system Under the ashram system, the human lifespan was divided into four periods. The goal of each period was the fulfillment and development of the individual. The classical system, in the Ashrama Upanishad, the Vaikanasa Dharmasutra and the later Dharmashastra, presents these as sequential stages of human life and recommends ages for entry to each stage, while in the original system presented in the early Dharmasutras the ashramas were four alternative available ways of life, neither presented as sequential nor with age recommendations. Topic ashrama and Purushartha The ashramas system is one facet of the complex Dharma concept in Hinduism. It is integrated with the concept of purushartha, or four proper aims of life in Hindu philosophy, namely, dharma piety, morality, duties, artha wealth, health, means of life, kama love, relationships, emotions and moksha liberation, freedom, self-realization. Each of the four ashramas of life are a form of personal and social environment, each stage with ethical guidelines, duties and responsibilities, for the individual and for the society. Each ashrama stage places different levels of emphasis on the four proper goals of life, with different stages viewed as steps to the attainment of the ideal in Hindu philosophy, namely moksha. Neither ancient nor medieval texts of India state that any of the first three ashramas must devote itself solely to a specific goal of life. Purushartha. The fourth stage of sannyasa is different, and the overwhelming consensus in ancient and medieval texts is that sannyasa stage of life must entirely be devoted to moksha aided by dharma. Dharma is held primary for all stages. Moksha is the ultimate noble goal, recommended for everyone, to be sought at any stage of life. On the other two, the texts are unclear. With the exception of Kama Sutra, most texts make no recommendation on the relative preference on Artha or Kama, that an individual must emphasize in what stage of life. The Kama Sutra states, the lifespan of a man is 100 years. Dividing that time, he should attend to three aims of life in such a way that they support, rather than hinder each other. In his youth he should attend to profitable aims Artha, such as learning, in his prime to pleasure Kama, and in his old age to Dharma and Moksha. Topic alternate classification system of life stages topic see also topic notes topic references chakrath p 2005 what can western psychology learn from indigenous psychologies lessons from hindu psychology in w friedelmeyer p chakrath and b schwartz eds culture and human development the importance of cross cultural research to the social sciences pp 31 to 51 new york psychology press Kriyananda, Swami 1998, The Hindu Way of Awakening, Crystal Clarity Publishers, ISBN 1-56589-745-5 Rama, Swami 1985, Perennial Psychology of the Bhagavad Gita, Himalayan Institute Press, ISBN 0-89389-090-1 Further reading Patrick Olivelle 1993, The Asrama System, The History and Hermeneutics of a Religious Institution, Oxford University Press, OCLC 466428084 Alain Danielou Virtue, Success, Pleasure, and Liberation, ISBN 978-0892812189 External links Four Ashrama of Yoga Pravriti Nivriti Social Action, Inward Contemplation and Ashramas The Four Ashrams, Iskand